Yeah, the crystal pool. The fuck? How did you get here before me? The frame rate, dude. <laughs> no, I'm not joking. It may look a bit choppy on your end. My end looks choppy. A load of the view. So I have to get a crystal cluster from this? Oh, God. Damn! I bet you didn't expect it to be so pretty, huh? You are always shining. Is it strange? There's even a weird rumor that you can meet people here who've passed away? Just need to get a little bit of the on the bottom of the fix that mess properly. That's where you come in. In. Aaron? But you want me to jump in? Yeah, I can't swim. And besides, my clothes would get soaked if I did. I had a real nifty Pokemon to ride on, right? Be fine. Uh, wait a second. What's going on? An earthquake? An earthquake? My Lodic! Ooh. Clock of all. I just. Why didn't. Look strong. You're actually lucky that I'm around. What do you mean? You're lucky that I'm here. Level 73. Switch out for Miascarada. I'm fine, so long as my Lodic doesn't know Ice Beam. Or a wheel. Damn. Come on, let's finish this. Am I able to catch it? Am I gonna be able to catch it? Nope. Not a goddamn chance. Fuck. Alright. Well, it looks like I'll have to get a Milotic the hard way then. Catch a Feebas. Yeah, catch a Feebas, give it a Prism Scale, then trade it with my buddy. But Pokemon like that one do show up here from time to time. Pretty handy to have around in a battle, aren't you? Wish I would have been able to catch that god taken my logic. That That's a crystal cluster? That's small. Well the crystals found within the crystal pool. Sparkle brilliantly and are apparently necessary to repair a certain mask. He was stuck to that Pokemon you fought? Didn't you come in? Didn't you come in from those crystals at the bottom of the pool? I knew it! Miss Briar! Come on, it's Shadow too. I thought you were. I thought you were paired with other students. Did you decide to. Uh, I'm sorry, Miss Briar. This place is pretty special. I'm not a big fan of outsiders just wandering around up here. They could grow. I did, get, I did get permission from the caretaker. Was that not sufficient? Why did you come here? I had a feeling there was interest in the properties of the water here. Yeah, well, my hunch was on the money. Pools waters emit energy of the same wavelength as crystal energy. Though I have no idea why that is. To be able to stabilize the terrestrial phenomenon in regions other than Paldea. Uh... Well, um, we've got somewhere to be, so let's head back, Shadow. Yeah, she's not wrong. I need a map and go back to Carmine's house, which means I need to. 
fly back down to the community center. Oive. And this is this is taking a while. Hey, Carmine's grandpa. Oh, we got the crystal cluster. Oh, did something happen? Hey. He ran off with the mask. Did he do that? Did you tell him about the? I haven't said a word. Sorry, I know you wouldn't just go blabbing to that. Seem to be headed to the Loyalty Plaza with him. I think it's best for you to go after him. Loyalty Plaza. That's a. Uh... That's where the first signpost was at. Here. Oh, item. Pokey doll, fuck you. Aaron? Aaron? Oh, do you think you're... You too knew, didn't you? Ogre wasn't the real bad guy. Well, three. The ogre's the one that gets treated like... You, you knew? And you two did the same thing. Uh oh. You didn't like it, Alka. You went and met with you. No different than those villagers back then. You know how much I love the ogre? And you didn't know anything behind my back all along. Not at all. Uh oh. Eh, I think he's broken. If you win, I'll give you back the mask. But come on. Fine then. You won't listen to reason? I have no I have no choice but to use force. Not gonna hold anything back. <laughs> Let's see what level you are now, because last time you battled me, you were at level 64. Oh, now you evolve Yanma to Yanmega. This isn't right, but I can't just hand over the mask to you. 68? Uh, not bad. Not a bad jump. The ice Spinner. Back from there. This. I got this. <laughs> About to send out Diplin. Uh, keeping. Super sweet syrup. I'm one shot in his freaking Pokemon. I can't help but be bored. So that's why I'm doing the sound. Cramorant. Oh. Um. Well, this was a bad time to have all these freaking like like little level 65 Pokemon in my party. Flower trick. Tech 
technically it would be neutral effective because it'd be super effective against the water, but not very effective against the flying. The hero in a story. That's because <laughs> he says that because I landed a critical hit. It's flower trick and always it lands a critical. And he never misses, so that's a bit broken. My gar. Let's go in, Miyazkorada. Can I be as good as you? Put my controller down. Oh! <laughs> I didn't realize that quite leveled up! I did not pay attention to the level up stuff. <laughs> so now Ducklet's evolved into Swan, huh? I was literally not paying attention to anyone leveling up during that fight. Centered around its leader, the flock dances in perfect sync to strengthen its unity. Like a... All of them doing a swan dance at once. That's it? Okay. No more evolutions. Man. Stupid! Why'd you punch the fence? Right? Here, I promise. Thank you! Say hi to the ogre for me. Hold on. about all that? He's probably not like this at all. Most people end up like that around the queue. Oh. Never let teenage angst get to my head. Here's something coming from the Loyal Three Merchant. These three, the greedy three, people call them loyal three, I'm going to call them the greedy three. Mm. There's Okie Dogie, Monkey Dory, Benzi Benzi uh, drrr, Benzi Dippity. Oh, what you? That doesn't look good at all. That all about Pokemon from the old folk tip. Right. There were three of them and they looked all sinister. That's gotta be them. They said they were laid to rest under the statue. Right? 
What brought them back? Wait, they ran off towards Kitakami Hall. It, that can't be good. Go after him. Come on. Oh, if that's the case, I need to bring in A team. I'm I'm sorry to you guys that are needing to uh, level up. Wanna? You're good. Uh, everyone here is good. I'm gonna put there. There and where, 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 where? You. I need a team, so. Look at this freaking team right here. Like a bunch of level 100s, and then there's armorers at level 94. Wait, wait, wait. Hitakami Hall, I can just fly there. Wait, I can just fly straight to the Ogre Alstein location? Ooh, that's even more helpful. I was gonna be a little bit annoyed if I had to fly to the bottom of the stairs. If it isn't Shadow, if only you'd been here a few minutes earlier. Hey, did those lousy three Pokemon come here? I believe you mean the loyal three, Carmine. Forget about that silly title. What's with your But yes, you did miss out on an incredible treat. We're just visiting our humble little. Didn't they wish to collect the shiny masks we've kept safe here at Kitakami Hall? So, naturally, we representatives of the hall here. We're happy to return the masks to them with all haste. Oh no. A platter of our special kit. I mean, much. Full of our best herbs. I will them up in a flash. And you fed them. Full of nutrition. They're bigger and stronger now, I'm sure. I guess the masks belong to Ogre Pond. Ugh, I really wish I could think. So, where do those three go? At once, the Ascend Oni Mountain. Perhaps they have it in mind to finish off the terrible ogre that, lurk that lurks in the dreaded den. No wonder they were dubbed the Loyal Three. Such hard working heroes they are. He's laughing at them? The story we heard is true, and those three must have gone to get revenge on Ogre Pond. They say the ogre fought using the power of its masks. But Ogre Pond doesn't have any masks right now, right? It won't stand a chance. We should help it. We're on the same page, but we should split. You head, you head to the dreaded den and help Ogre Pond. I'll go back home to get the mask fixed up. Give me the mask and... Thanks. I'll head your way the moment the mask is fixed. Until then, make sure Ogre Pond's... A good thing I came prepared. Let's see. Crocoval, Meoscarada, Skeledurge, Cerule Edge, Armor Rouge, and Mimikyu. I'd say that's a pretty good lineup. Sure, there's three fire types on the team, but come on. You got water fighting, grass dark, fire ghost, another fire ghost, a fire psychic, then you got a ghost fairy. Not to mention, uh, I think if I remember correctly, I know Qu Quackaval is hyper trained for sure. I think, um,. I know... Okay. Krakowal is hyper-trained. I don't think I'm hyper-trained Miascarada or Skeledurge yet. I don't remember if I hyper-trained... Uh... Cerulege and Armorage. But I know for a fact I hyper-trained, uh... Mimikyu. That much I know.
don't have time for you guys. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, poor Ogre Pond. Okay, so I have to deal with Monkey Dory first. I'm gonna say... Low Sweep? Not very effective, huh? But hit speed did fall. Okay, okay. Wait, wait, are they poison type? Oh fuck! The only one that would have a stand chance against that is uh, Armorers, but the only psychic type move he has is expanding force. Try liquidation. Okay, that works. Neutral. Go three against one. Uh -huh. Not too much to. But now that way, <laughs> make you regret ever coming back. Ah, there we run away. Too much for them to handle. Well, say it properly. Uh, about the mask, just got so angry and. What I did was real dumb. Sorry. I'm sorry too. Thanks, Shadow. Just sulking around, so I grabbed him by the collar and dragged him here. And, well, I'm glad I did. Who are you? The real life ogre? Something. You wanted to be the one to give the mask back to Ogrebon, right, Kiki? This is for you, dude. Scared. Maybe it's not good with new people, Kiki. I think it'll take the mask if I'm the one to give it back. You should be the one to do it, Shadow. Aww. Looks so cute. Pretty comfortable around you, Shen. It'd be nice if we could give the other three masks. If we could give the other three masks back to Ogre Pond too, don't you think? Did those did those three Pokemon take the masks that were at Kitty Kami Hall? Yeah. Never mind that masks right. Never mind that. The mask rifle was the one to or Ogre Pony. I wouldn't put it past the so-called Loyal Three to plot a second ambush, either. We need to keep Ogre Pond safe while we deal with them. That means the three of us are going to form a team. The Mask Retrieval Squad. Count me in. And you get to be my second in command. I can come too? Of course you can. Now that that's settled, let's go gather intel about those Loyal Three and Mosi. We're gonna get those masks back. We can do it.
Ogapon will now follow you around. Aww. Oh, it's so cute. It's so cute. Am I able to fly? Oh, I just realized. <laughs> Oh, I fly there, the cutscene automatically activates. Okay. What's wrong, Ogrepan? Bet it doesn't want to go into the village. The villagers did a pretty good job of chasing it away back then. Yeah, you're right. Okay, well, maybe... Maybe Ogrepan can wait for us here. We can go gather information while it waits. Do you think it'll be okay? Pay attention now. We go in village. You stay here. Okapon stay. You understand? I'm gonna take that as a Wait for us here to look. <laughs> Looks like I understand that. What was wrong with what I said? Maybe it only listens to me and not you. Wait. I gotta see Okie Dogie. Okay. And it's the Okie Dogie mask. <laughs> Lousy 3. I love that title. Emoji, I kid it coming. Pheasantipity. Oh, the yellow icons. Pheasantipity zoom, zoom through the sky over Oni Mountain. Which cool in the story say? That's a blue right there. How about you? You see anything? Yep, this is. Nothing from you. Nothing from you two. You're in? I think I'm going up and talking. Monkey Dory. Someone had collapsed. So I went to check on them, but it was just Monkey Dory taking a nap. It's gonna be so peaceful around that pond out there. Please first news. That's a clue for Monkey Dory. I got a clue for Pheasant Deputy being an Oni Mountain. Monkey Dory being around a pond. What pond, though, is it? Is he talking about? Talking about this pond over here? In Wistful Fields, something like that? Huh. And I need a clue for Okie Dogie. Dory. I got Monkey Dory and Pheasant Deputy. Okie dogie, okie dogie, okie dogie, okie dogie. Here we go. Okie dogie of Arthur. Where's this? It's not wandering around in the, the barrens? Okay. Okay, okay. You got Monkey Dory by sleeping by a lake. You got Peasant Dippity by uh, up on Odi Mountain. And you got Okie Dory. Uh, okie dokie by the Paradise Barons. Alright, let's combine the info we've got. You, you go first, Kiki. Well, here's what I heard.
My throat is killing me right now. We know exactly where each of those lousy three are hiding. What'd you learn, Carmine? Look, I'm the leader here. Lending work like gathering info just doesn't suit me. I tried talking to a few people here and there, but they got all nervous and stuff. Just too pretty. <sighs> I'm just too pretty for my own good. I'll record everything we found out about those three on your two Rotom phones. That way we won't forget anything. The fuck is that case? Okay, so I was right. Monkey Dory is by the pond I was looking at in the bottom left of the map. Let's go retrieve those masks. We can do this. I'm not going. What? You're part of the team. As long as Shadow's around, I'm sure Ogre Pond will. Right, I've got things to do. Sorry. Huh. Oh well, I can't force him to tag along. Let's take care of him. And decide where we head first. Let's get all of Ogre Pond's masks back. Alright? Ogre Pond is too cute. Uh, you know what? Let's go for Monkey Dory first. Wait, nope. Have to. Gotta freaking fly over to yeah the shrine, the loyalty plaza time post here. Go down this way. Fucking spinner rack. Fuck you. Ogre Pond. Something right here. Wistful field. Throughout this entire time recording, this is my first time coming over this way. Oh, there's a Munchlax. I'm gonna catch that later. Alt. There's a Grudovin. Oh, man. I wanna do all the story stuff first before I deal with more of this. Uh, oh, Mass Outbreak of Hoot Hoot. That's interesting. Bro, you are so big now. The fuck? Taki looking on. That huge head must mean it's Monkey Dory. I may be wrong, but has it gotten big? bigger than when we last saw it? Put this one in its place. Rockaball and more Pico. Okay, now I get to finally learn what uh, Monkey Dory's typing really is. The Titanic Monkey Dory. What is it? Poison Psychic. I'm sorry, but this freaking music is.
Oh, Ogre Pond cheers us on. Okay. Who's got a weakness? We can just keep using that move till it faints then. Good move because it's paralyzed. Hell yeah. It, oh, it, it ate some. It ate a berry, and then it just went back to normal. Okay. Bye bye. That's what you get. That's what you get. Look, it dropped a mask. Oh, there's one of the masks. Yeah, we got the first mask back. Well, spring mask retrieved. Aww. It sure is happy. You know, I feel this way at the crystal pool too, but we make a good team, don't we? Two masks left. Take the rest to the loyal. Let's take the rest of the loyal three down. Okay, next I'll go for Pheasant Dippity, so. Eat what the f there's a sensu style order choreo. <laughs> Ogre pun. That that is the destination. Okay. Now here's one. Here's what I'm thinking. I don't know what they're. I don't know what Fezendipity or Okie Dogie's typing are gonna be, but, but here's an assumption for me. Because Fezendipity is a bird, I want to say it's at least a flying type, which means a uh, rock type would work or electric type. But who? Oh, oh! Oh! Wait! 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 I need to get I need to get down on land first for this. Where the Kitakami Ogre Clan? I'm gonna talk to you later. Actually. Since Cerulege is the stronger fire ghost, I'll put Skeledurge back in the box. The same thing with Armor Rouge. I'm gonna bring out Tyranitar, and then I'm gonna bring in Crocodile as well. Sure, they're level 88 and 85, but Tyranitar is rock type. Crunch, Rock Slide, Stone Edge, Earthquake, yeah. Crocodile, 85, Earthquake, Dig, Crunch, Foul Play, plus Anger Point. I love Anger Point. So if I'm lucky enough and one of them lands a critical hit, then by all means, bring it on. Here we go. Well, I need to piss real bad. Oh, there's Pheasant Dippity. Inside the cave, okay. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Like I said, because it's a flying type, make Tyranitar the lead Pokemon. Chilling Waterhead, what this place is called. What? Oh. Wait, is that a Tynamo? Yeah, that's a Tynamo. There's people in here. There's a Gumi. Hello, swine. You're in the way of the frickin' Pokeball, dude. Ooh. Got Swinubs, you got a Sneasel, you got a Gumi. 
Wait, maybe this is the area where the pursuing ones are at? What? Animo. There's a Mianfu there. What's in here? Nest ball, finally. Whoa. Okay, not that way. Wrong way. Like a maze, dude. I, I, I love mazes, but holy fuck. And I've touched, I freaking encountered a swine up. Okay. It's neutral because ground types are resistant to rock, but ice is super. Uh, but ice types are weak to rock types. There's a whooper. There's a carbink. I haven't seen a narrow passage like that since Gen 5. Holy fuck. Arbink. There's a nugget. There's a Tynamo, some Sneasels. A Gumi. Antidote. I'm finding a lot of Tynamos here. There's a Dunsparce right there. Magikarp. Ghost Terra Shard. Something up there. Blizzard? That's a difficult one to get, though. What the? Oh. Freaking Barrascuta. Man. A quagsire in here. Icicle spear? There's a revive. Parents candy M. Damn it, get off the wall. Here we go. <sighs> There's the one that fell. Isn't it, baby? It's gotten bigger too, huh? Time to bring this one. Yeah, I didn't encounter pheasant dippity before, so I I don't know if it's gonna. Because during that first battle, it was Monkey Dory that I fought to protect Ogre Pond. Not Pheasantipity or Okie Togi, so I don't know what the uh, typing for this one's going to be. No, it does not. I'm taking the chance that it's at least a point.
Portico avoided the attack. Oh, you have play rough? What? Does more damage. <laughs> what are you talking about? Oh, hungry more pico. Okay. So, what about crunch? Yeah, I know play rough was gonna be super effective against uh, more pico like that. Not very oh and this makes it a little bit complicated now I'm trying to think if it's not very effective wait he he's a bird She's a bird, and yet rock type didn't do much. Maybe. Maybe Pheasantipity is fairy poison? And because Monkey Dory was poison type and psychic. I'm taking a risk. The risk that I'm taking here. Yeah, all three of us are going to be buffed by the sandstorm. Let me at least, like, test it first. You're going to knock yourself out from recoil. Okay, it, so I think it is part poison. Best grunt. Okay, if I want this to get knocked out quick, I am going to use Sword Stance twice. Then it's Cha. Hospitality. Nice. Macho, that's... Really? Forward. Thank you. And Sandstorm subsided. I really thought Pheasantipity was going to be part flying type. What in the world? Not very effective on Cerulege. Critical hit? Neutral. Okay, let's get the extra power. Very effective pheasant dippity, sorry. My attack fell so Tox Toxic Chain? The fuck? Well, that's not good. Good thing I'm using Bitter Blade. Well, my attack fell, so it went from being times 3 to times 2.5. But I still have a lot of power. Yeah, that much power? <laughs> Damn! Okay, you know what? Just as a precaution, I'm putting Cerulea as the leader for the party. Only Tyranitar and Crocodile get the XP. Pheasant Deputy had to have been Poison Fairy type. Right? That's what I'm thinking. Ooh. Drop the mask too, just like the last book. Yeah, yeah. Uh, 
back where they belong. Hearth flame mask retrieved. Let's go. No opponent's gonna give us any trouble so long as we're a team. Come with us. Oh, one more mask. Make this loyal one a lousy one. Then I hear So his icon is his icon is close to a grass type terrestrialized crystal up there, so uh real and that a fuck me. Wrong button. You Orthworm tarnish, what the fuck? Bear candy, let's go. There he is. Antidote. God, I gotta piss real bad. Oh. I'm about to take on this last of the lousy trio. Yeah, it's almost to the five hour mark. That's a buff one. Okie dokie with all of its mean muscles. How is it they've all gotten bigger? Break. And the says time to cut this Pokemon down to size. Literally. The fence rose sharply. Oh, God. I've heard. Well, if you want to do that, we just it hard way. Close combat. Is it part fighting? All of the other ones, all of the other ones used the typing, uh, a move that matched their typing. Pheasant used play rough, so I assumed it was fairy. Monkey Dory used psychic, and it was it ended up being poison psychic. Okie Dogie used close combat. So, does that mean it's part fighting? Is it poison fighting? Wait, if it's poison... Oh, no. <laughs> if it's poison fighting, it's four times weak to Psycho Cut. This is gonna go down bad. Damn. Psycho Cut. I just gotta see how much damage Psycho Cut deals. Let me see. <laughs> Damn! I see a nice analysis there. I just took and no. Let your leader have the last attack, okay? No shot, more Pico's gonna get fucking. Crunch. Yeah, it's a random attack, you know. You're not gonna get the hit in with the frickin' Aura Wheel on that one. Not very effective, but here comes me. Bitter Blade. Give me some HP, baby. Damn. I was at 150, now I'm back at ma max. Uh, you had a freaking berry? Lechi berry. Oh, okay. Close combat. And there goes more pico. Special defense spell, okay. Didn't it increase its defense, uh, physical defense at the beginning? So that means... 
So its special defense is down twice, its defense went back to normal, and its attack went back to normal. Use Shadow Claw. Take that. Eddie was damaged by the recoil and Shadow Claw. There. Okay. Real quick, I need to go piss. back as soon as possible. Hello. You're like the ogre and he will bring up others full. There it is. Mask. This one's the stony one, isn't it? Congratulations. In the rain, too. Cornerstone mask, which... All worked out. Right, Urga? Oh, I... Why did you... I'm bring the... Third seat? Oh, this doesn't fall. Oh. I wonder what's everyone in the village thinks that Ogre Pond's a menace, right? That's what everyone believes, unless if he told the truth about what uh, about what happened. Hey, he did have a didn't look in his eyes. That's true. True. And head to the village. Things go south. My natural charm to smooth things over. Your natural charm to smooth things over? What are you talking about? What natural charm are you talking about? Oh, there's an item here. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? I'll assume. Oh, fuck. Okay. I've had an idea. Take Orgopon back to Mosio Town with you to see what happens. <sighs> I hope this doesn't go bad. I hope this doesn't go bad. Damn. And then I'm here. Let's activate the cutscene. You really don't want to be here, do you? Don't worry, it'll be fine. Hey, what's this? Really? Get Ogre. But. Just trust me and come with me. Now you got me curious. Uh, 
That's the ogre. Actually, real? This is the ogre of Oni. True face of Oni, whom we've so sorely watched. Far too long we've told tales cast villain here. Oh, you are great. Yes! What's going on? Why this sudden about fate? Aaron's been running around the whole village telling me what happened. I was worried he'd stir up a lot of resentment, so I told him to stop, but... Sorry, dear ogre. Not so cute. And stuff. It was wrong to worry so much. I know Kiki had it in him, especially since he usually hates talking to me. <laughs> From now on, you can come to the village. And you don't need to. You do. Three masks we kept in at Kitakami Hall rightfully belong to you. If you managed to get them back from those three villains, you are welcome to keep them. <laughs> we got the we got the masks back and we managed to clear Ogapon's name. And that's what I happy ending. That's what I would call a ha happy ending too. One last thing to do, let's court Ogapon back to its home. Escort Ogrepon to the dreaded den. I don't feel like fucking walking all that way, dude. That. Fly to the crystal pool, dude. I do not feel like riding on Karidon all the way back up there. Especially considering the fact it is already now past one in the morning. <laughs> I've been recording Teal Mask since eight o'clock. I have, so I've been recording from around 8 o'clock until present, so, like, uh, it says the recording time so far has passed 5 hours. And I know, like, the first 3 hours or so, the first, like, 2 or 3 hours or so of me recording Teal Mask, because I was alongside my buddy Richard. And after that, I've been just going solo. Here we are. It's a bit lonely out here, but I guess this place must mean a lot to Ogrepan. Take care, okay, Ogrepan? What are you doing? You know what? I think Ogrepan might want to go with you. Wow! That's... Hey, hold up! I'm not gonna stay here. Then. I wanna... Kieran! I'm gonna come with me! Kiki... No one being real selfish. No, play! Which one of us should get to keep Ogre Pond with them? Hey, Kiki. I know you really... I know you really love Ogre Pond. I really honestly understand. But you have to think about Ogre Pond's feelings, too. I want to battle anyway. Let me know once you're ready. Bro, I have my A team. Right? I have a freaking team right now. You're gonna get fucking decimated. Bro.
Put Mimikyu at the front, just for the hell of it. Just for the hell of it, put Mimikyu at the front. Ready to battle? Yeah. Let's get started. Wins. Whoever wins gets to be Ogre Pond's partner. Not like that. Well, don't you dare hold back. No trainer. This is new music. Probably a better trainer for Algapon, but I. I. Oh, yeah. Hey. Focus Ash? I won't hold back either. You and Carmine, Burrow. Dude. I'm sorry, it said Probable Pass? Now, if I remember correctly, Probable Pass is Rock and Steel, so it'd be best if I brought in... That's four times, that would be, uh... Crocodile. Plus Anger Point, if... I see Anger Point get activated once, it's over. Sturdy. What was that? Betraya Berry boosted special attack. Body, body press? Damn. Holy rat, so best if I did Neoscrata. Oh, we both have a full team. Play roughs, power trick. Super effective and critical. What is the number? But it doesn't matter. I got this. Now I got this. You've lost three Pokemon so far. I haven't lost a single one. But the only difference is that Crocodile and Mimikyu both took damage. Gen Mega, that would be a bug. Fine. Slide. Bug buzz. Ready to send out Gly score. My score is ground flying. So that would be Quackaval coming out.
Not to mention, I do have uh, Ice Spinner. Damn. Gotta do it like that. Get you, Barry. Weaken the damage. Only I would get damaged by the sandstorm because ground types don't get damaged by that. Is that, is that five of his Pokemon so far? Diplin. You're tired of losing. Well, guess what? You're gonna lose. I knew Diplin was still in that team. Just didn't know when he was gonna send it out. He literally fell to his hands and knees. Figures. Damn, dude. That's rough. I couldn't win. Just couldn't give up. I think it's time for you to catch Ogre Punch. Prove myself to Ogre Punch, it says. Wants to test. Ogre Punch wants to test its strength against me? Oh, fuck. Yes. Here we go. Oh. It changed? Whoa. Yes. This is what... Embody aspect. So we're look oh yeah yeah, fire type. So a fire type like this. So best bet would have been either Quackavel or uh, Tyranitar or Crocodile. More likely either Quackavel or Tyranitar because you got they're both resistant to fire. Grassy terrain. Huh. Well, it's good that they used. It's good that Ogrepan used that one as the first move. It gives me a chance to do another sword stance. Ivy Cudgel? Jesus. The fuck was that? Hey. Uh, let's do sword stance. Or Shadow Claw. Oh. 
Wow. Memories of adventuring with you grant Ogapon strength. Oh, here comes the blue one. Do I still have my attack up? Body aspect. Raises its special defense. Yeah, I still have my attack up. Wellspring mask. <laughs> Bro, that was your mistake using grassy terrain on the first turn. Memories of working together to retrieve the masks to grant Ogre upon strength. Do I have to go through all of them? Oh, this one's, uh, all the freaking cornerstone mask. Increases the defense. Oh, boy. This one would be... Yeah, rock type. Not completely, apparently. Ivy Grudge. Oh, this would be rock type. Wow. That took a lot of HP out of me. Cornerstone mask. I think there's one more mask. One more. There's one more mask, and it's the teal mask. Memories of a partner from long, long ago grant Ogre upon strength. Here we go. It's true mask. Embody yeah. aspect. Increase it its speed. Oh, it used... Oh, it went first. Oh, fuck. Okay, so we're looking at a grass type right now. That would be, uh... Skrill Edge. You're up. Ivy Cudgel would be grass type right now, so it's not gonna be very effective against me. He only took about like 70 something HP away. I'm using Sword Stance and then Bigger Blade. Grass disappeared from the battlefield. Oh. Oh, there goes the grassy terrain. Never mind. You adapting to Ogrebond's type. I knew you could handle this. Yeah, yeah. Now's your chance to catch it. That's it. Yeah, that's everything Ogrebond has. Wish I had a better ball. Ogapon was caught. Mask Pokemon. This Pokemon's type changes based on which mask it's wearing. It confounds its enemy with nimble movements and kicks. Let's uh, uh, let's send Cerulege back, actually. Pokemon will be added to your party, and Cerulege will be sent to your boxes. Pokemon! But there's only two po- Entrusted you with the Cornerstone Mask, Wellspring Mask, and Hearthflame Mask. 
You put the masks in your bag's other items pocket. Eh? Congratulations. Don't worry, I'll take Ugh, I hate when he gets like that. Don't worry about him. He's the one who said the winner gets to become Ogapon's partner. Come on, let's head home. So now I got Ogapon in my party. Honestly, Ogapon's really cute. Next day. Morning. Carmine, she says she's waiting for you at Loyalty Plaza and that you should hurry up and meet her there. Hey, why don't you always use me as your messenger boy, huh? <laughs> I don't know. No. Have you seen crystals like the ones in the crystal pool back in Paldea? <laughs> yeah, I have! They're in Area Zero. <laughs> That's what Miss Briar said! Miss Briar asked if I've seen uh, crystals in Paldea that are like the ones in the crystal pool. The only ones I can think of are the ones that are at the bottom of Area Zero. Alright, Carmine. What you got? Look, he took you. Hey, yes, sir. Guess the mask retrieval squad completed its mission. So, Kiki. Oh, he shut himself in his room ever since he got home yet. That's worrying. Yeah. Oh, but you don't need to. Filtering. Shadow. It all started because I said we should keep the whole Orgopon thing a secret. You wouldn't think it, but Kiki's got a bit of an ego too. He doesn't think losing well. Anyway, how's Orgopon? I'm fond of Orgopon myself. Guess Kiki's rubbed off on me. Let me have a battle with Orgopon? Yeah. Want to turn down a good battle when you're ready. Wait, Ogre Pond's female? What the fuck? Where is it? See, here's the thing though. Most majority of her Pokemon are dark types. What? Wait, what moves does Ogrepan know though? Oh. Ivy Cudgel, Low Kick, Slam, Grassy Turn. Hmm. Let's see what else. Double kick, counter, retaliate, horn leech, wood hammer, superpower, power whip, spiky shield, I, uh, synthesis, throat chop, low sweep, growth, focus energy, vine whip, leech. And what is it? The heavier the target, the greater. Okay, you know what? No, 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 no. Give me low sweep. 
Change low kick to low sweep. See terrain though. Hey. The Pokemon has any stat lowered by an opposing Pokemon. Max stat will be boosted sharply. Oh. Freaking keep. Um, I want to actually. The user drains the target's energy by its horns. The user's HP is restored by up to half the damage taken by the target. I want to get rid of grassy terrain, actually. Powers up grass type moves, too. Yeah, yeah. Just depending on its mask. So, is it all set and ready to go? Yep. I actually didn't look at the definition properly for Ivy Cudgel. Probably should have done that. Go on, Carmine. Uh, Mighty Anna. Oh, good upon us. Wake up early for this, you know. You better make it worth my time. Why'd you wake up early for it, then? The fuck is wrong with you? Defiant? <laughs> Attack stat was lowered, and then was... Uh, the user strikes with an ivy-shaped cudgel. This moves type to changes depending on the mask worn by user, and it has heightened chance of landing a critical hit. And let's see. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You should hit where it hurts, don't you? But you're real popular back at home. I mean, I am a champion after all. I am a Paul Dayan champion. So what do you expect of me? Oh shit. This probably won't be well. I'm burned. Critical hit. Could have sworn it was gonna be a regular hit. <laughs> Very funny. That oh I forgot when someone uh, when you have a burn status, your physical attack is lowered by a bit. Okay, well. That's the case. Let's bring in Krakowal. I wish I had more experience candies and rare candies for Ogre Pond before doing this battle. About to send out Morpico. Electric Dark. And I forgot about the focus set. Man. Okay, 
uh, pretty sure you're gonna use Aura Wheel, so in the meantime, I'm going to use a full restore on Ogre Pond. Burn was cured, and then Ogre Pond had its HP restored. Oh, Seed Block! Wow! That's a surprise. So, Ice Spinner. Leave Annie. I'll keep. Sinistra. Eh, I don't know. Oh, this is her final Pokemon. Okay, no. never mind. strong. All student, since all student pairs have completed their orienteering as of this morning, I wanted to have some words, so could you head back to the message received? Wow. Armin is with you. One last phone call I have to make. It never ceased to amaze me. Some fast friends the most been even the briefest amount of time together. I'll head on over to Community Center. I'll be there with the rest of us. I guess that's the end of the trip. Right about it being the briefest time. We only just became friends and now we... Oh well. Let's go see what that nosy old guy wants. I don't really want to, but I guess I can play nice one last time. Come on. Come on. Down this way. Down this way. Here we are. I'm still in the freaking. Uh, I'm still in the festival clothes. Well, most of us are here anyway. Let's all give him our full attention. Told that our student pairs have now finished visiting all time boards in Kitakami, which means your self-guided tour is at an end. Yeah, we found all. Oh. Hey, thank you for saying so, and thanks for taking part. On that note, I've got a little gift for each of you. Here's the Kitakami Mochi set from the Caretaker. I didn't think you'd wrap up the tour this quickly. You're quite the prodigies. Our visitors from Paldea still have heaps of time left to enjoy Kitakami and have all it has to offer. 
Continue to make your souls at home and explore as you please. However, I'm sorry for suddenly springing this on you, but I'm Kieran and I will need to return to Blueberry Academy a little early. But why? Again, yeah, truly sorry, but there have been some developments concerning the Great Crater. I'm afraid we really must be happy. There is your ship wrong, but you can have all proven to be very capable. So well, you'll be fine without me. Looking after them. Don't mention it. You can leave these kids to me. Roman, I believe there's something. Yeah. Fortunately, my brother's not feeling well, so it's just me here. To As you all know, this village is where I was born. I don't want any outsiders come here at all. It felt like our home was being turned into a tourist trap for a bunch of ignorant strangers. But then we spent some time together, and none of you were the way I imagined you. We were all really nice once I actually talked. It shouldn't have been quick. It shouldn't have been so quick to judge people I didn't know anything about. I guess what I'm trying to say is, I had fun. Thank you all so much for visiting our village. Especially you, Shadow. I'm glad you came to visit. I mean, it's not like this is goodbye forever. Blueberry Academy has tons of strong trainers. You better come visit soon. Indigo Disc! I still need to get back to you, I think. <laughs> Not goodbye, okay? We're definitely gonna see each other again. Timing on the rain, dude. What timing on the rain? <laughs> That's funny. This car of mine for you. I you never know quite what to expect from her. Each moment spent with you kids is just for an adult like me. <laughs> it's blinding. Anyway, that about wraps up this school trip. I'll give our caretaker a big, great big thank you. You. Karen? Hunger. Karen? Karen's stronger and stronger. What? Right, you can't do that to me. To be continued, you motherfuckers. All right. So that is basically the entire storyline of the Pokemon Scarlet Violet DLC, the Teal Mask. So I managed to do that whole story in give or take five and a half to five forty. Damn, this is long. I'm going to save. Ogre Ogre Pond is really cute as far as I've seen. And I, I'm really happy with how this DLC ended up coming out. And obviously, I didn't do everything for this. I didn't do everything here. I, I didn't catch all the Pokemon. I didn't catch, like, do all, all that crazy extra stuff. I'm leaving that for off camera, but I will record my react. I know there's supposed to be a 
I'm supposed to catch Ursaluna after I register 150 Pokemon. That that much I was spoiled on when uh, from a news headline. Um, I I still need to catch the lousy three as well, because that's a that's a choice. Now I might I might record my reactions to catching those Pokemon. I might not. Who knows? But regardless, Heal Mask came out perfectly. It was a big surprise for both me and my buddy Richard, who was here at the time when Prof uh, Doc Professor Jacques showed up and gave us a Pokemon egg, and it turned out to be one of the Sinnoh starters. At it just whichever one you get is based on which starter you pick at the beginning of the base game. So, like for instance, I picked Quaxley, I ended up getting Piplup. Richard picked Sprigatito, so he ended up getting Turtwig. And I know, and since his cousin, he, he picked uh, Waikoko, so that means his cousin is going to get uh, Chimchar. And just like we did with the Paldean starters, we're going to all have to trade with each other, so we can all have one of each. Well, after we breed the, the after we breed them with a Ditto, of course. But regardless, came out perfectly. I'll I'll give it. I'll give it a 10. I'm giving it a 10 because of how great it is. The storyline's beautiful. Kieran, I'm very much worried for Kieran because of his mental state. I'm gonna speak. I'm speaking from experience. That mental state is not healthy for anyone, no matter what age you are. So if you feel like you're going down that rat that path, please find some help. Before it's too late. Otherwise, you're going to keep pushing people away and you're going to be left alone for the rest of your life. Not, it's not healthy. All right. That's it for, that's all for the teal mask. I'll see y'all when the indigo disc comes out or maybe I'll see y'all when I have to go up against Ursaluna and the lousy three again. Peace.